hello hello everybody welcome back to pink crafty world today i have another shopping haul and this shopping haul is from tuesday morning um a lot of you guys know that tuesday morning it's uh reviving <laughs> their craft section again so i saw a couple videos here and there i was trying not to spend money for several weeks and boom i decide to go ahead and go wrong thing to do but i didn't buy too much at uh tuesday morning but i still i wanted to share but i have to say they have a pretty decent selection of items um at tuesday morning and here is what i did get let me start um Let's start with the Christmas items that I did grab. The first thing that I did get is this gingerbread garland. Uh, it's 60 inches long. And it's the cutest thing ever. First of all, when I did get it, I thought that this was uh, ornaments. So I said, perfect, you know, I can put them in my Christmas tree. Then when I get home, I did notice this is a garland. I'm in love. I love it more now than before because it's an actual garland and it has the uh, gingerbread house and it has the gingerbread, which uh, it's going to be a little bit, you know, hard to share because this is close. But let me try to open it real quick. <clears throat> Maybe if I open, I open it from the wrong side, of course. It's okay. But, okay. Yes, it's so pretty. I'm going to try not to undone the whole thing. But couple of the houses and couple of the gingerbreads. Oh my God, look at those. This is how... This garland looks like, look at the other house. Oh my God, it's super, super adorable, super cute. Oh my goodness, I just love it. Love it, love it, love it. Super beautiful. So like I mentioned, it's 12 inches. It's not too, too long, but it's not, not 12 inches. It's more than 12 inches. I don't know what I was thinking. Um, it's 60 inches. <laughs> I don't know what I'm thinking. It's 60 inches long, but it's super cute. So I'm in love with this because I have these um, type of shelves in my kitchen. And I know that uh, I'm going to display them from uh, those there. Or, I don't know, somewhere. But I, I know this is the cutest thing ever. And, yeah, I just love, love this. Super adorable. So, that's the first thing at Tuesday morning. Then I found these kitchen towels. And I couldn't resist. They're $5.99. So, it's not bad price at all. And it has the gingerbread girl and the gingerbread man and the bunch of the cookies. And there are two. And the quality is amazing on this. So, of course, I have to have it. I think I have another set from last year that it's um, one of these. I'm pretty sure. So, yeah. Then I get into the craft stuff. And the craft stuff, I didn't grab too many. But, of course, they have some Maggie Home stuff that I couldn't, you know, pass. I have some of these, but, you know, why not more? <laughs> so, I did grab the uh, uh, stickers from the Maggie Home. Um, I forgot the name of this collection. My goodness. But you guys know it's a summer one. And it's so cute. I have this collection. I cannot think right now. Sorry. 
It's part of the issues that I have with the fibromyalgia, so I apologize for that. Um, I have the name in the tip of my tongue, I swear. Um, but yeah, I did grab that. It was three uh, two ninety nine, and I grabbed uh, one of the garden party. I think I have like three of these. Well, two and a half, cause. But this is my favorite collection of Maggie Holmes. Uh, of all of them, Garden Party is the most. And I think I have the most products of any of the collections that I have from uh, Maggie Holmes. I still have a lot of leftover from every single one of the collections. But these are bought so much stuff. And I keep buying. If I found more, I keep buying it because... I don't get tired of creating with this collection. It's so, so beautiful. It's my cup of tea. Okay. Then, I have so many punches. And punches is something that it takes so much space. But a few weeks, no, not even a few weeks. About a week ago or, I don't know, a couple days ago. Um, a sweet friend of us uh, in the channel her name is Disco Dolly. Hi, Cynthia. She shared this punch. Oh, my God. Never. I went online trying to find it because I did fall in love with the punch. I love bows. I love butterflies. And I couldn't find it. Well, I found in, in I think in eBay, it was like 20 some dollars for this puncher. And I decided... No, nah, I don't gonna buy that for twenty some dollars. No, but when I went to Tuesday morning, they did have the puncher for twelve ninety nine, and I said that's a way better price. I had it right there on my hands. You know, it's gonna come with me. I don't have to wait. I don't have to pay for shipping. None of that. So, yes, you're coming home with Mama. So here I have the bow puncher. Oh my God, I can't wait to use it. It's so beautiful. This bow is super cute. I'm in love. So Tuesday morning has this punch. Bueno, a la, at least my Tuesday morning did have that. Another item that I did found at Tuesday morning is the Market Square Ephemera. I do have some of these um, ephemera packs, but this is a collection that I did. I don't even play with the Market Square yet. I have it. I don't use it yet. And I didn't buy too much of this collection because, you know, some collections, um, like, I like all Maggie Holmes collection pretty much, but some of them, I don't like them as much as other ones like garden party i have tons of stuff marker square is one of the the collections that i have the least but i decide to go ahead and grab the ephemera because ephemera is something that we always use that we always incorporate in our projects and for 2.99 i don't think it's a really you know bad deal especially when you pay in the store you bring it home with you you don't have to pay for shipping, so can't complain. And then I grabbed these uh, from She's Magic from Dear Lizzie. Um, I don't think I have the collection, or maybe I have the six by eight. I think I grabbed it because I have the six by eight on this. And even though if I don't have it, I can use it. I can incorporate those in anything else, you know. So the tickets are super cute. They go with anything else because the, of the colors, you know. The colors are so, so cute, so why not? I, I love this. This collection is actually very, very cute. I was looking for more stuff of this collection because this collection is um, from 2019, um, but they didn't have anything else. So... um. I did grab an embossing folder, a 3D texture embossing folder from Zizix. And it's 
this one here. I think it's very pretty. And uh, it was $4.99. So this is a little bit pricey. And then I grabbed three dies from Zizix. Um, shouldn't buy no more dies. I have a huge collection of dies now, so I don't need no more. But anyway, I did I did grab this one. Uh super cute. Uh it's from Olivia Rose uh for C6. And I don't know, she created the cutest things too. This is super adorable. Uh it has a bunny, a bear, and a fox, I believe. And yeah, it's like a packet, you know, like a tiny packet. It's a packet pulse. Um, so you create the packet and then you put, oh my God, and it looks super adorable. So I have to have it. Then I grabbed this one here um, from Sizzik. Also, Olivia Rose designed this. This is was $10, but love this die with the envelopes and the typewriter. Just a note. Super cute, adorable. Again, she it's she creates beautiful dyes for C6. And uh I get this one. Um also so beautiful. And is this like a frame uh type of dies and with the floral pieces. I it does came with the floral pieces, is a layer labels. But I like the size. It's perfect for card making, especially. It's great for embellishments. I love the stitching on this. It's so pretty. And the dots on this is gorgeous. And yes, it came with um, the flowers, you know, that you can uh, use to embellish these. And this is from Jessica Scott. Super cute. Um, the designer is Jessica Scott. When I said the name of the designer, that's why I like to mention them. They deserve credit. So that's why, you know, every time I share a C6 die, I try to look um, the name and share with you guys because these designers, they work hard. And I think if I des design something for somebody, I would love to, somebody, you know, the people to give me credit to mention my name and you know, so, so so people know that hey, this person was who actually designed that. Um, but yeah, and yeah, that was everything that I did get at uh, Tuesday morning. So I think you know they're doing good. They have, they did have a um, few paper pads. Not few. They have a lot of paper pads. Um, more dice, but the dice that they have, you know, they're pricey. So I have to watch also my budget. Um, a bunch of um, those box cards, um, paints, print brushes, um, washi tapes. Everything is like going back to the normal self of our crafty section at Tuesday morning. So I'm very, very excited about, I'm very, very happy about that. Uh, I don't know how much I'm going to be going because right now my craft room is overwhelming but you know uh it's good to know it's good for people that is starting their stash and all that so yeah i hope that you guys enjoy the video enjoy the small haul from the tuesday morning thank you so 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 much for watching don't forget to subscribe to the channel hit the bell button for more notification like and share this video and i hope to see you soon in another haul or crafty video. Bye-bye now.